Guys, sorry about the camera angle, but we got my new package. This is a giant box or something that's not that big. Um, so this is my new keyboard. It is the Apex 70K, I'm pretty sure. Um, that's the name. The other one that I had in my PC unboxing when I built the whole setup, that keyboard was really bad and we got scanned. Like, not really scam, but what they said really didn't work, so we returned it after they gave us back our money and everything. It was a horrible keyboard. I think it was called, like, the Diaria. Don't get any of their stuff. It's just not that good. It always glitches out, like, the Windows key and the Escape key switched roles, so the Windows key became the Escape key and the Escape key became the Windows key. Like, yeah, it was just not good, so... We have the Apex Pro, oh no, Apex 7 TKL, sorry. Let's just get into it, so. As you know, most of my unboxings, I, I use scissors, but I'm using this now, and it's just a lot smoother. Okay, just... Okay, this is really taped weird on the set. Hold on, give me a sec. I don't want to cut myself because that's probably the worst outcome. Okay. Here we go. I'm not on this one. Yeah, alright. Close this. We don't need this for now. Okay. I'll let you see it first because. Oh, yeah. What do you guys see? That's what you see. A ton of bubble wrap. You already know we're saving this for later. Oh. Okay, that's a horrible... That's a, we're saving the bubble wrap for later. Because you already know. Okay, oh, this is a heavy... That's so... That's a... That's a... That was like... I was ready for it to be light. So I was not ready for that, but okay. Now let me move the camera angle. Sorry about my fan. Alright. This is it. Apex Press Sunday. So it is compatible with PC, Mac, Xbox, and PS4. It does come with an, I think it's called like an OLED screen or LCD screen. It's like an OLED screen. You control with that. Uh, there's some macros over here. Um, and the keyboard. And this part is detachable, I'm pretty sure. And I will be showing on my PC uh, the software you can use. Just because. I'm trying to show you if it's good or not. So here. Trying not to cut myself while doing this. Because in case it doesn't work, I need to... Oh. It's just that I have to do it carefully, but yet I'm ripping the box. This is your A-plus review, by the way. Oh! Uh, let me move the camera down so you can see. Sorry if it's like crooked or anything. I'm just trying to move it. Here's your look at it. That's what you see first thing out of the box. That's what you see. It says Steel Series 4 Glory. Okay, so you take out this part. Okay, let's put that here. That's hot, like it just feels hot. I mean, okay, never mind. Let's forget I said that. Like, I thought it would be, never mind. You know, just never mind. Forget we said any of that. This is a mammoth of a cable, first of all. Okay. I did get Cherry MX Red switches, I'm pretty sure. Okay. okay. So there's the keyboard. That looks nice. Thick. I mean, it's pretty thick, manual. Okay, and this should be the pad, yeah. The pad. The pad that you can, like, remove by magnets. It's actually... It's pretty good. Okay. So this... Alright, I'm gonna go put this stuff all away. And get it, like, clean up. And then I'll get back, okay, guys? We're back. Just cleaned up. Put the box and pop the bubble wrap. So let's put the manual here. First, I think let's unbox this. So, this is like the pad thing. 
I don't think most people play with this when they use it. There we go. Put this in there. Ooh. There's a bit of dust there. So it feels like. Alright. Take your stick, seal the series headset. This feels exactly like this part up here. I think it's the same material, probably. If it feels exactly the same. It feels really good. So you just feel like this. Personally, I'm not going to play with this because I just hate the way it looks. Just move all that annoying dust out of the way. Okay, I'll put this here for now because I won't be really using it by now. The reason why I waited 11 hours, no, like 24 hours for this. I know it's a long time, but... I was going to get the Ducky one too many, but then I just realized this had more features on it. Because my friend wants one. And... Okay, there we go. Slide it fully. I don't want to press any of the keys yet. Okay, I thought I already scratched it. I'll unwrap this in a sec, but let's just listen to the keys first. And they are. Can you even see that? Cherry MX Red. Oh gosh. God, I'm, my tripod is hitting my mouse. Okay. I don't know what the Steel Series button does. Probably opens the functions. Holy. I, Booga uses the same keyboard, so. Yeah, I got the Cherry MX Red switches. Okay, so this is, I'll give you a sound test really quick. Escape key. Space bar. Arrow keys. And number keys. The F keys and macros. Okay, that was your A plus sound review. Okay. So it is metal. It's not plastic, so you're getting that good stuff, if you know what I mean. Yes, alright. Definitely a good keyboard. Oh, I'm just so used to the escape key being right here because I use a 60% normally. So escape key's not normally up there, but I gotta get used to that. I do like that the uh, ASD keys are like, I don't know. All right. So I'm gonna get my PC turned on, plug this in. I'm not sure what you do with these two. I think you plug them both in. This is a keyboard. It, it says, it's like, you can see like those little dots, right? That's a keyboard and that's just a USB thing, I'm pretty sure. All right, I'm gonna get back, turn on my uh, monitor and PC and I'll plug it in. So yeah, let's go. Hey guys, I tried to do my best to like angle it, but I'll hold it up later on so you'll see anyways. What? All right, so when you tap, look at this, look at this. When you tap, like, that's up in the holy, but this keyboard is insanely good. Okay, I don't know what I just wrote, but if you type in steel series engine, I already downloaded it, but just click on it and it'll open gear. Apex 7 TKL right there. It already shows up, which means you don't have to pair it, which is good. Shut that. Okay, so this is how you change the OLED screen. So, first, let me take off the the 
Like, holy row, that looks sick. Alright, I'm just gonna see it with this. You definitely like it without, like, the, the pad on it. 100% like it without the pad. Okay, so. Upload. Let me see. I got this like huh, all right. I wanna get back to when I find out um like where that picture is. Okay, guys, I got it. So I wanted the Supreme logo on it, because off what you can't do. So apparently you can like change it from white to black, but I have no clue how to do that. Okay, so it's on the thing. That's what it looks like. That looks sick. That looks sick. Alright. Okay, so I don't want the grind on. Done. Oh, this. So it doesn't change. So you're gonna have that white, like, outline. With okay. Okay, that's so good. Okay, right, so that's what that looks like. So that's my illumination. What do you, how do you do this? What does this do? Oh gosh. What did I do? What did I do? I have no clue how to do this. Oh gosh. Wait. No. Oh, oh God, what did I do? Yeah, let's just not talk about that part. Um, it was in one of these. There it is. Done. Put that Supreme back on, illumination. I don't know what the, don't know how this works. Okay. Okay, so ripple is like this when you tap and like, like you can see like that. I'll show you everyone. Okay, you can change the color? Holy, all right, all right, let's do, all right, take this, go straight to yellow. A yellow ripple, like how many functions does this keyboard have? All right, well, off. Sorry, bro, ski book. But no. Color shift. What does that do? Color shift. Uh, still kind of confused on how all this works, but Prism. Alright, so Prism is just like the, the different colors changing. Yeah, I don't know which one. So this one just changes like the light colors. How do, can I make it like, I wanna make it like off. Oh, the keyboard's just off now, the colors are off. Wait, so can I make a yellow then? Okay, that's that's yellow. It looks more like green. Just know if you want yellow, it looks more like green. That's just... Let's try yellow. Yellow looks like green. Okay, so you maybe have to go darker yellow. Yeah, yellow looks like green. It doesn't look like that. I'm just going to say it right now. It does not look like that. Yeah, I don't know how this... I don't know how this works. What is fade? Oh, that. Okay. So, I'm just going to do, like... What is that? I'm not trying to find... Okay.
I'm just trying to see what all the colors are like. I don't want I want it white. Yes. White. Uh AFK effect. I could care less about that. Okay, like my question is what color do I do? This. Yeah, this is just like I'm just trying to see this is that, so I'm probably keep it like this. Um OLED screen illumination. Wait, what is Oh, you can go like up the keyboard. Like, okay, I don't think you guys can even see that, but it can go up the keyboard. Okay. Oh, this one goes out and this one goes reverse, so that means it probably goes in here. But I think the horizontal looks the best. Ripple off. How, can I change it to one color? Like, if you want solid like light blue like no light and blue like that yes no Wait. oh that okay this is rgb so this is every color this what is this i like this rgb every color yeah and i'm probably gonna put you can just look at my settings to see. Uh, what does line do? Oh, line is the one that's the line's the stock one that it comes with. Like it, it is online, so just know that. Yeah, I think I'll just keep it off for now. Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna keep it RGB for now because I don't know if you can like change your color. The color, just, like. Just do this. Does that mean that I can like change the same one? This. Don't know what that exactly did, but definitely did something. Okay. Okay. How do I unselect keys? Yeah. Let's just zero key selected. I'm just trying to RGB or this one. What's this one? Because you know, Booga just has it all blue, but I'll just keep it RGB because it looks nice. Alright. Close meta binding. I have no clue what this means, but we're just going to keep on Mara. I think that's. So, this is like you can make the configure. What the heck? What did I do? Hold up. Wait a minute. Oh, that's what. So when I click, it's blue. So, that means fade is on. Which means it's on. Like, what? Mate, this keyboard's confusing. I'm gonna say that right now. And I have no RGB anymore, so. Yeah, that's. I don't want it any color, so please make it white. Thank you. Why is it yellow? Like. White. Holy bro, that's. Ah, this keyboard's annoying. All right, you know, I'm just gonna get back to you when I get this done. I didn't get it because I was on the wrong configuration because I tapped two by accident. So this is it. Supreme OLED. All right, so now let's just go through the OLED screen. Have no clue how this works. Um, okay then, we're just gonna all right, guys, so this was the end of the review, and yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye.